This is a geometric mean program. First thing you have to do is ungroup it. And they all ungroup like, like that. And then you just simply go to program, you hit second quit, go to program. And it doesn't really matter if you check if you choose the first one or the second one. I'm just gonna choose the first one and it comes up with this. These are the possible things that, that you can have. You can have X and Y, A and B, A and Z, uh, B and Z, Z being the hypotenuse. It's attached to a get key, so if you, if uh, the F1, F2, F3, F4, and F5 gives you function, I'm going to hit F5 for more. More brings me in here. If I want to go back, see the original option, brings it up. Uh, for this purpose, I'm going to say I have X and Y, which is normally what you see in the textbook. And this is the calculations for all the different parts of the triangle. And I'm going to use the values 3 for X and 8 for Y. And as you can see, it calculates it all, gives you uh, each part of the triangle, including the Z value, which is the hypotenuse. And then it goes a little further. It gives you the area and perimeter of the triangle and each side of the triangle. And last and definitely not least, it gives you uh, each angle of the triangle. And if I want to do it again, I can. Or I can hit no. And no brings you back here. That is my geometric mean program. If you have any questions, just send me an email.